I mean, I like, I like this team. I do like this team. Um, we're going to go with this. Now, what I'm thinking is, so we're just swapping one weapon. Is that going to make too much of a difference? What I'm thinking is that the charge attack from the Code Orange Assault Rifle is a grenade, essentially, and... Um, I didn't check Maggie's armor, did I? I should have swapped out Maggie's armor and put tactical on. Very silly of me. All right, okay, that's 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 what's happened. Oh no, it's not a grenade, is it? It's just a it's just a, a bonus attack. That's My gosh, I've made some some silly mistakes here. I'm using them. I know it's only wave 2. They were they were just lined up so perfectly. How could I not? Okay, what have we got coming in? Uh, loads of good stuff. It's all stunnable. So let's do that. Let's make sure that we're getting lots and lots of targets with Carol. Lots of chances to get some charge points. Not that she seems to be making the most of it. Definitely going to miss the ability to keep things stunned for two turns. That's what we've got with the old decimator, but hey-ho. Get you on fire. <laughs> it amazes you that some Japanese audiences watch me on YouTube. I can't tell you how flattering that is. You know, I've always wanted to go to uh, Japan. Someday, I am absolutely certain that I will, and it's just, it's wonderful to hear, it's, it's flattering, but, um, you know, YouTube, it's a, it's a global, it's a global audience, I've, I've had people get in touch from, from every, every single country, obviously America, Germany, Canada, France, Ukraine, uh, just, just everywhere, and of course, yes, Japan as well, Italy, and, and I'm, I'm, it's, it's wonderful. I mean, really, it is, it's pretty breathtaking. You did good on this same setup, top one percent. What was your score? Because I mean, I'm, I'm, I've been looking at my scores, and I've been absolutely aghast. I mean, they just, they just don't seem to be very high scores at all. And I'm wondering if perhaps. I'm being really bad, or if this is just sort of a low-scoring session for the last stand, if, if, if everybody's sort of finding, I mean, significantly, I'm getting way less than uh, seven figures. Okay, good. I mean that score multiplier is still staying is still staying low. We're not getting uh, you know normal walkers or anything that would help sort of bump that up a little bit. Did one run with uh, Rosita Survival Rick and Non Hero Warrior. That was the best round forty four. Well, my gosh, that's significantly higher than I've been getting. I'm getting to about wave 12 or so. It's just, it just ain't, ain't really sort of coming together. Um, which is a shame because we've got some, we've got some good heroes available here. 
Right, is everybody on fire? Yes, they are. Mm, we could hit the barrels. But I don't think that that's really going to help us too much. Rosita the, with the Barazi helped me on that run. Yeah, that thing's a, a pretty great weapon. It seems to suit her as well. Uh, the new S-Pole, the, the weapon from the seasonal event, I've not upgraded that yet, actually. So I've not been using it. Um, I think it looks like a good one. I mean, we gave... I gave the Requiem a go, and, and I do think it's good. I mean, if it come out a while ago, it probably would be absolutely fantastic. The fact is, though, I think that the range kind of kills it a little bit. Um, but yeah, the S-Pole, very, very intrigued, very keen to give it a go. The S pole is excellent, better than the first. Right, yeah. Um, yeah, I, I, I think it. I mean, it, it did. It just it looked really, really good. So I've no doubt that it's it's something special. I'm keen to use it. Probably do a little video showcase on it as soon as I've got it all ready to rock. You know, that's always fun to do. Let's get you cooking. Good looking. Okay, so you're not rooted or stunned or any of that silliness. So let's make sure we're avoiding you. Everyone's safe there for the moment. You're in a bit of a tricky spot, but that flipping helps. Good. Yeah, and of course, the more hits we're getting, the more chances that we have of getting some charge points. Oh, God. I've got to remember that I do not have tactical on Maggie, which is a, is a huge mistake. You can see how it's, how it's affecting me. I'm just... I'm so used to having tactical. It's like having additional range on a shooter weapon. You just get used to it. And then when you don't have it, you feel like something's wrong. Okay, uh, yeah, I mean, we've got two targets that we can hit here, so that's what we're going to do. What I would like is to get you, get you good. Mm hmm. Right, you're already stunned. Uh, would you care to do the same? No. See, I was thinking, I was thinking about detonating those barrels, but he, that metalhead there would have had to be out of action. Otherwise he gets whoever flicks the switch. So, uh, yep. Get you out of the picture. I think we should probably just keep the charge attack. There's not a ton of reason to use it there. We've got some bad guys coming in right behind us. There they are. Don't know if they're happy to see us because I ain't happy to see them. Okay, 
Uh, now I know we've got a, a little piggy there who is potentially uh, problematic. What we could do is that. Okay. Now I would have liked it very, very much, sir, if you had done the honourable thing and just, you know, collapsed. Get those guys slowed the heck down. Let's get you. No, we haven't got tactical, so we can't do that. Let's get you cooking. That's something at least. Move to position first, then shoot. Ooh. Come on. You know, what about them barrels? Uh, let's get that armored walker cooking. Let's get a charge point here. Easy kill. Let's try and get into a slightly better position. Try Rosita and Carol and survivalist Rick. Carol with the winter harpoon gun. Rick with the flag. Yeah, okay, sure. I could do that. Let's hold on to Rufus's charge attack just because we've got some scary stuff coming in. Okay. Right, so what do we do here? Rosita definitely with the Barazi. I've I've got the Barazi, so that's that's kind of cool. I don't often don't often break it out and use it, so it'd be fun to uh, uh, to do that as well. Good, both those metal heads are on fire. Everybody's cooking. Twenty five percent hit point damage. Hmm. That sounds like a tasty treat. Keep you there. Get rid of you. Slow you down. Bring on wave 15. Our score is, is still very, very low. Helps to kill those tough metal heads. Yeah, and I mean, I guess that what you're doing as well is, is you're making sure that you're hitting those metal heads with a melee character as well. So that's... You know, they're, they're not negating all of the damage that you might otherwise be causing because when you do this, when you shoot them with a ranged character, they're very resilient to, to that kind of damage. So, got a lot of stuff coming in next turn. I think I want to be sure that I am well prepared for it. So, let's do that. Um. Connie, just is that's that's just it's a preference. So it's not to say that Sasha is is particularly worse. There's some things that she can do better. For example, you got you got more freedom of movement with Sasha. You can put anybody anywhere that you want. Uh, you don't have to be cuddled up to them at the end of the turn or anything like that. So Sasha definitely she's got some she's got some strengths. Um, but Connie, I just, I just find myself using her very, very frequently. I would, I would never be uh, ashamed to bring Sasha along on a battle. If it's like I've got to take her because I can't take Connie for whatever reason, it's like that's fine, absolutely fine with it. But I think in in terms of just. Maybe it's how I play, or, or 
you know, something. Uh, I, I, I think Connie just, just works a little bit better for me. Might just be a personal thing. Depends on the situation. Uh, both are top tier. Yeah, I mean... There's, there's no two ways about that. They're, they're both absolutely top class characters. They really are. Okay, what, what are we going to do here? I think we do that. Stun these guys. Let me do that to root you in place. Carol's got to get out there or else she's she's ending her turn right next to that tank but uh that works out for us that's okay so if we can kill this armored guy we can stun him that's pretty good i think um I think we've got to slow these guys. We've got to slow their roll. Magagi has got to go here. And she does that and that to hold those guys in place. We get out of range. We are being surrounded. It's, it's a bit of a rough one. And we've got two unstunnable walkers right next to us. What we can do perhaps is just... Kill the damn things. That's a pretty good solution too. Good, I'm glad he's stunned. Um Yeah, you've gotta be slowed down or else you're gonna get to Maggie. Give these guys a little bit more attention. Tried uh, uh, two scouts with both flagpoles. You can confuse so many walkers on the map. Yeah, I bet that that is just a, a massive confusion. I can imagine that's really good fun. You're just going to have walkers brawling with each other uh, left, right, and center. Stay where you are. Stay where you are. Oh, you're not on fire. I think the positioning is working a little bit better than it did for us last time. Uh, can I do this? I think I think I can use a charge attack there. I don't think that's crazy. Let's hold you there. Let's get you cooking. Bring on the next turn. Okay. Uh... Right, yeah, we, we kind of want to be in a better position than that, really. Guild War will use you, so much fun. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, it's really interesting to sort of see him being used to very good effect. I mean, he's, he's definitely not being considered a top tier character, that's for damn sure. His use might still be circumstantial, but it was it was impressive stuff. He's just there, just tanking so much. Why are you not ensnared? You're within one space. Cheater. Morgan is a top tier hero. Uh... Okay, I mean, the thing is, uh, yeah, definitely things change. So I'd be keen to, I'd be keen to listen to that. I'd be keen to give him a go. He certainly wasn't a top tier hero because it's a case of that if you get hit by something that's that's strong enough, you just you just get reduced to your red health bar. It's just that's what happens. Um, obviously, I've seen some of the efforts that people. Oh. <laughs> Just kidding. I get you. You did get me. You did get me. The thing is, there's 
there's sometimes some options. There's there are ways that people have used characters, and you've just thought, well, that you know, they're 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 useless, like Eugene, and then somebody does something a little innovative with him. Jerry, I've seen Jerry actually used to good effect. Yes. Um, I don't know if I could bring myself to do it. He's absolutely one of the best characters in the show as well. It's, I, I think he's, he's had an image as a laughing stock for so long. Okay, lots of targets there. Let's get them all cooking. Let us, uh, let's try and put you dogs down. Okay, looks like we're being backed into a corner. Not always a bad thing. You can sometimes create a stun wall. Uh, we, we now have a target rich environment. So Rufus can hit lots and lots of targets, get lots and lots of charge points every turn. Let's see if we can stun. Yes, we can. Uh, you. Oh, Maggie, it would have been wonderful if we could have rooted that chap, but okay. Rufus, you are doing God's work right here. Keep it up, fella. Yeah, I mean, we're talking, we're talking sort of stun wall here. We're, we're kind of getting rudimentary stun wall. Can't hit that tank because he's behind a metal head. Is it worth even using a charge point? Um, I don't think so. I'm going to hold on to that. Oof, double tap that target and he still didn't get on fire. Okay, Rufus. You had one job. To stay fully charged up so that we can take care of these guys. Okay, right. What do we do here? I mean, we do this. We do this. These guys can't get to... Oh, yeah. You could go down, couldn't you? Um, what about this guy? Not so worried about him anymore. Okay, lots and lots of stunnable walker types. That's great news for us. Looks like we need to introduce some of you guys to the concept of being on fire. You're a metalhead. Um... Yeah, I kind of need you stuck there, basically, so that you can't can't keep blocking attacks. Okay, he died. That's good. Yes, thank you very much for saying that. This is this is turning into a, a, a pretty decent run. The the previous two were uh, they were a mess. They were. I'm not going to lose any sleep over it. It's a it, you know, it's a game, but um. They, they they were bad. They they weren't they weren't very good. Right, you need to stay in place. You need to stay in place. Score multipliers ticking up as well. What we could have done with there is some bloody charge points. Especially for you, Rufus. I cannot express how disappointed I am that you did not get some charge points there. Maybe what we can do, can we stun some of these guys? No. You're a risk. You're a risk. Right, let's Okay, good, good, we didn't die.
Let's hold you there, let's hold you there. For the assault weapon CAR, what do you recommend for traits? Uh, sorry, which one's the CAR? Probably a dumb question. It's probably really, really flipping obvious. I'm just... I guess I'm a little distracted at the moment. Right, we need you guys... Right, I've got a whole bundle of people that I need to root. Um, oh god. Right, you've got to you've got to die or be knocked out or something. You've got to be rooted. You are a big big problem because yeah, I can reach Maggie. And she kicked your ass. Right, we don't need to, to worry about him because he's going to craft it. Oh, CAR, Champion Assault Rifle. I mean, obviously, yeah, we're using the old... We're using the orange one right now. Um, that's... Good for that. That's good for that. We are surrounded by flaming, groaning corpses. It's probably really freaking unpleasant. But... You know what? We kind of, we kind of are doing okay. Right, we can do that. We can do that. You can't get to us. Uh, no, don't go running right up to them. They might be immobilized. That's not the same thing as being incapacitated. So stay where you are. Okie dokie. Is everyone going to be saying that now because of the Fallout TV show? Okie dokie. Let's get you guys cooking. It would be nice if we can reach you. Yes, we can. You just stay where you are, Mr. Tank. Okay. Uh, yes, that's okay. We're stunning him. That's that's good for us. Maggie, it would be lovely if you had some charge points. We've got to worry about him and we've got to worry about you. Oh, Thank you very much for watching. Uh, yeah, and thanks for the comments as well. See you around. Good luck with your own last stand. Um, yeah, we might be able to just... I, I need to put a little bit more hurt on that tank there. Just, just, just concerned that he's not going to do the honourable thing and uh, die. Oh boy, I wish I had tactical because I need to root these guys... You know what I could do. That should guarantee that he's dead. Yep. Ooh. ooh, 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 ooh. Look at that. They're right up in our faces. Can we stun? Yes, we can. Oh, we can do this. We can root him, that's, that is a good thing. We can root him, that is a good thing. But the problem is, come on Rufus, we've got, we're on the last week of Guild Wars, which is when I like to uh, use my supports. Um, I, think we're, I, th I think we're having a lot of fun with this run, so let's just keep it rolling, shall we? Let's just... Keep cracking on with that. Lots of stunnable stuff out here. 
good. Um, no, we're better off trying to make sure we get charge points. Well, that didn't work. I want to need him crippled, and I need those ensnared, which I I could do, but I, I can't get him crippled, so we don't do that. Not a lot of value in using a charge point in these situations. Good, that was good. I'm glad that these guys got stunned. Those guys got held where they damn well were. Now, problem is... So we can do this. We can cripple these guys. We can... Do this. And we can do this. He is not crippled. Damn, and neither are these guys. What we could do... What we could do is this... You, sir. Oh, I could potentially get Maggie. All right. Okay. This is why I bring dog. No point in shooting that tank because we can't. It's not that like we can stun him or anything, so. We can do that. We can do that. We can do that. Yeah. Nothing can get past us. Damn it! Sometimes when sometimes when walkers die, it's it's actually kind of annoying. You don't want it to happen. Now we've got a little gap here. I mean, frankly, we've got some... Okay, this is... Yeah, yeah, that's... that's. There you go. So again, by far the best score that we've we've had in this run, but but not a, a, a very high score in general. I, I I thank you very much for saying that. I, it's definitely been a fun one. This has been a heck of a challenge. That is for damn sure. And I think we did okay. But my gosh, tough. Tough last stand, this one. You know what I am proud of? We detonated the barrels. We go down, but we've blown up a load of walkers with those exploding barrels. At least I feel good about that. I think at some point, I'm going to have to... I mean, I'm going to have to make up for this. Probably have to make up for this as well.